Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Um, I'm gonna play something a little different today. This is gonna be a one-off probably. Um, so this is Erica. It's like a live-action interactive movie essentially, I believe. So I'm using my phone app to uh, control it so I can be like the quiet life. Um, <laughs> and yeah, so I think it's just sort of a film length, but you get to make the choices of where it goes through so it's quite an interesting concept um, and I don't really know what to expect it's gonna be interesting that's for sure yeah it's it's saying this right so when I first started it up it I wasn't sure if it would just go to a menu or not and it seemed suddenly like it was actually loading the game so I haven't actually played this because I immediately bailed out when I realised it looked like it was going into um, the game. So <laughs> that's why it's saying this. I was just like, uh-oh, what's this? So, um, yeah, that's just, I have to see. Yeah, I saw this bit and then I was like, this seems like it's the thing. <laughs> so this doesn't look like it's going to a menu. Uh, what is it? Forever Yours. Does it say Allody? Okay. <laughs> this might take me a little while to get used to the controls. Ah, uh, this is really cool. Am I like... Okay, so it's showing me like if you go inside what's on the thing you'll light it. Okay. This is cool. I wasn't expecting this. I thought it was just going to be literally like when you're doing choices and pick options kind of thing. <laughs> Drag to explore. Oh, okay. So I can like and you let go and it does stuff. Oh, so I can actually direct her to go and do stuff. This is so clever. I don't know if this is our main character, just as a younger version of her. Erica, you shouldn't play with it. It's dangerous. Okay, are you ready? Mummy and I met many, many years ago in a place called Delphi House. She was a nurse, I was a doctor. This is really cool. I'm just like doing things. At night, well, maybe should be like this. Tell each other stories. She tell me about the future. Wonderful things. Things only she could see. I tell her about the past. About a great priestess, marked with a butterfly, who could stare into the fire and see the future. I used to tell her she was magic, just like the priestess. I think you're magic too. But you're gonna have to prove it. Pick your photograph. Pick your favorite. Uh. Which one should I go for? Oh, that one. like in Harry Potter. <laughs> now, close your eyes. Focus your mind. And conjure the power of the ancient priestess. Now find your room again. See if you can guess where your favorite is. <clears throat> oh no, I don't know. 
Okay, for the right one. Hey! <laughs> See, magic. She'll always be with you. Is there a hint to that? Remember that. I didn't notice Even it. Even though she isn't here, she's still a part of you. <laughs> if you could stare into the fire and see the future, what do you think you'd see? Oh, no, that's not what I meant. That was not your fault. <laughs> How is that like, facing it? It can't have been her fault. She was a child. Watching the lovely neighbour throwing up on the stairwell. Okay. Secure or unlock? Let's see if they're okay. Do you need any help? Sounds really timid. This is interesting. I wonder if she'll like become strong over our journey. Oh, we've got the picture that we chose. Not that I think she's weak or anything, I'm just saying because she's timid. She'll maybe get braver or confident. That's the one. Can you like look at oops things? Who's that guy? So my dad was murdered. Why didn't we get killed? This is cool. Drawing. <laughs> Yeah, what is that? I don't know if this has got like a supernatural element to it or if it is just a... Um, 
murder mystery type of thing. So I think that's the basic premise. Uh, I was going to say there's loads of flecks of red on that. That's got something bloody in it. Is that a hand? Miss Mason. Not have this pass, this I'm Sergeant Blake. I'm Sergeant Blake. The lead investigator on this case. Can I see that? I promise I'll give it back. And it will rip out. This rip out seems a little bit suspicious, don't you think? You draw this a lot. It's Greek, isn't it? In Delphic Epsilon. Same as with your father. How do you know that? I read your father's file. I had to. The hand belonged to a Cal Jahar. You worked at Delphi House? I believe you visited there with your father. Is that the guy from the photo? Did you know he co-founded Delphi House with this man, Lucian Flowers? That's not the guy from the photo, it's just someone else. We think Mr. Flowers might be a target too. Okay. Look, we're keeping watch over at Delphi House. Protection detail. I'll be leading the investigation from there right now. It's the safest place for you, too. Same person that killed... Well, I assume they killed that guy if they put his hand in a box. <laughs> I am already so intrigued by this. This is really, really cool. Delphi House? Or is this just somewhere else? How many times do I have to have it? <laughs> I was like, I'm going to do loads. Okay, denied. We're probably out for a smoke. Wait here, I'll go check. Oh. Ah, we can look at stuff. Let's have a look at this picture. I can't look at anything specific. Or can I? It's not giving me my pointer, so I think it's just looking around. Yeah! <laughs> um. Tell me it's a fancy dress party going on or something. <laughs> Phone, that, or somewhere else. Let's go for the phone. Erica oh, Mason, I have waited a long time to speak to you. Did you like my gift? Um, I kind of want 
Monty. How now? Who is this? You were so alone, holding on to your father, covered in blood. Was her. He's not who you think he was. Follow the music. Find Alodie Carter. See what he did to her. See him for who he really was. Was our dad the bad guy? Who will I find? If you don't look, you'll never know. Find Elodie Carter. See for yourself. Elodie was the name on the lighter. So who the heck is Elodie Carter? Follow the music. music <laughs> I don't know which way the music is was it through the private door because I went the other wrong way so oh this isn't creepy is it <laughs> what's that oh a little fox a little fox Erica <laughs> What are you doing? I told you to wait. Um, should I tell them about the phone call? Or the masked girls? That was a phone call. It was a woman. She knew who I was. She said. She said. Inside now. I feel like I can trust this guy. That might not be. Uh... We need to find out where that call came from. Do whatever it takes. Case. What are you doing? Get over the phone. Yeah, go on. Yeah. Ooh, what would have happened if I'd gone through that door, I wonder? And you? I have a right to see your identification. This is a private facility here. You can't just walk in. I don't have ID. Everyone has ID. Look, I'll call you back. Yeah. I'm Sergeant Blake. I called this afternoon. I'm supposed to meet a Dr. Ballard. I can only apologize. We're all a bit nervous here. Sergeant Blake, I'm Rosa Ballard. I suppose you already know Chief Inspector. Doctor, thank you. Would you mind taking Erica up to her room? I'm afraid I need to speak to the Chief Inspector. There's been a development. Mm. I'm already, like, really wondering what would I happen if I'd done the other option. Me. I worked with your father. I used to look after you. When you were little, I remember you'd run around the basement looking for ghosts. You knew my parents? Of course. Your dad taught me everything I know. And your mum, she was incredible. Brilliant nurse, so smart, it's funny. Anyway, this is you. You might recognize it. This is where I stayed when I was little. Hey, there's a fox on the wall. Mr. Steinbeck, the night manager, will be downstairs if you need anything. I don't like Mr. Stein, the night manager. If that was the guy that was on the desk. <laughs> he gives me creepy vibes. Oh, this is the room we stayed in before. What did her dad do then? It looks like he did some sort of history thing. I gotta let it actually focus on it.
So how come all her dad's stuff is still here? If this is her dad's stuff. This is the song that she was playing when we were in that first scene. Classic event, like finding your father murdered. pretty creepy doll. <laughs> There's nothing yeah. I like more than a creepy doll. Fantastic. Hey, it's got my um, birthmark on it though. She's just like you. Why didn't she get killed? They kept her alive for a reason. And it's, it's... <laughs> Did she fall asleep with the door open? Because that's weird. <laughs> Not found that, Besley. Did she get shot? Is that why she sat up? Did she get shot in the stomach or something? Bruising. What the hell? <laughs> that got me a little bit. Just a little bit. Yep. Yeah. Follow the music. Like a... No, 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 no. Not the carpet. It's clean. Um... <laughs> Go around. It's the other option that I could have just bowled across it. Kirsty, I said you can help, but I need to be with you, okay? We talked about this. No cleaning without supervision. Is this like a um, psychiatric house type thing? I'm not sure what the word is. Can't think. What? Um, I don't want one, and I'm not going to confront you, so I'm just going to back off. Nothing. No, we should confront her. Death wish. Over here. 
Don't mind her, she's got emotional problems. Yes, I can tell. Hurry up and die, Hannah. I'm doing the best. What are you playing? This. Aria Fidelphi by, um... Some guy. I don't know. I've never heard of him. Here, take a seat, let me show you something. See this bit? It's simple. Four notes. Bam, 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 bam. I'll do the rest. If all I have to do is tap, then that's fine. I can do that. Do I have to do it in time? Blake's here. Needed in the main office. <laughs> I'm like, did, that, did I do the right thing? Come in. Hi, Mr. Man from the photo, whose name I forgot. Lucian? Was it? Erica Mason. You look just like your mother. <laughs> Last time we met, you could barely see over the desk. I'm Lucian Flowers. I set this place up with your father. I uh, recognize you from your portrait in the hall. Oh dear, it's quite a statement. If it wasn't for your father, I'd have it replaced. <laughs> Did you sleep okay? I know the old place can take a bit of getting used to. Um... Last uh, night, the, um... The man on the desk. Mr. Steinbeck, yes. I believe he was rather rude. Just a bit. I can only apologize. I'll be speaking to him personally. I know it's very difficult for you to be here. And it's not much, but I brought you something. It was your father's. Your mother gave it to him on their the wedding lighter? day. It is. So. I just. Is Aladi my mum then? Kept a hold of it. Hey. Sorry about that. We're chasing the phone company, but there's still no news on last night's call. Erica, it's extremely likely whoever killed your father killed Mr. Johar. There may be some other victims as well that we don't know about. Is there anything I can do to help? Honestly, we don't have much to go on. But well, I Mr. Think Flowers the has a suggestion. Are gonna be coming to me. It might help you remember the face of your father's killer. I get flashes. 
nightmare is a, a silhouette a woman with a gun, but that's it. It's like therapy. It was developed by your father, and it might be able to help you with your nightmares. It's completely painless. Perfectly safe. We might as well, hey. Okay, okay I'll, do, I'll do it. The images you're going to see are designed to relax you and open up your mind. Your father designed regression therapy to help our patients face their trauma. The first one is just a test. When you see it, just say whatever comes into your head. Yes! Like, okay, okay, literal. Great. <laughs> if you remember anything important, just write it down. I know revisiting trauma can be difficult, but you're perfectly safe. Let's begin. Oh, no. What happened? We connect, please. Uh, I think we're back. Okay. Don't know what that was about. It was just like choose your PS4 system. Um, beauty. Beauty. Faith. Why would milk be one? Fun. <laughs> Gates milk Danger. Danger. Eh. Mm. Kill. These are suddenly going like really weird. It's too fast. Why is it why is it saying suddenly going so quick? Part of the uh, thing. This is weird. I like it. It's you, Erica. It's always been you. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I thought, like, we were actually going to see... Draw your mother. Oh, we're just playing. Eh, can't flick it. <laughs> I can do it. Your mother told me this place was her whole life. She worked here, fell in love here, had you here later. She died here. How did she die? I've not said that yet, have they? Dr. Ballard suggested that I show you this. Putting yourself through that was incredibly brave. It's not surprising that you saw your mother. I'm just looking for like a cause of death. Does it say on there? Am I being blind? It's a process, Erica. It takes time. You can't blame yourself. Uh, I'll be determined. 
I want to try again. You need to rest. Try and bolster her. Mind. We can try again another time. Come on. There's something I want to show you. You'll we'll need this. She is. Well, they're more like secateurs, really. Aren't they? <laughs> Sneak. Aldi Mason. What was the name that they said? Aldi Carter. Is that her maiden name? I wonder. Wife, mother, and dearest friend of Delphi House. It's not in our power to love or hate for well, us I can't read that very well. When two are stripped long so I can't read it. <laughs> I can't read it! I'm just like screenshot it and zoom it in. Your father had the oleander planted in your mother's memory. They were her favourite. They've always brought us luck. Is that the aggressive one? Sorry. Sometimes the girls have difficult days. But some of us like to keep it buried deep down inside. Anna, I didn't think you'd be up. This is Erica Mason. She'll be staying with us for a while. Didn't I bleed all over you this morning? Hmm. I'm taking you these to Doc Ballard. We're making perfume. Do you want to come? Uh. <laughs> I thought Erica was going to say it for a second. I was like, Actually, they're about to serve lunch. It's quite a spread. Why don't you go and grab yourself a bite and maybe meet some of the other girls? Sure. Who doesn't love a good old soggy sandwich in the company of strangers? I want to check on Toby. Maybe I should check on Toby. No worries. I guess I'll catch you around. Ah, oh, okay. I feel bad now. It's very good of you to go to her. Just remember that some of the girls here, they can be quite manipulative. Just be careful. That's yeah, I'm just thinking I'd like a fire on my side if it comes down to it. <laughs> but that's cool though, because that's two different paths there that you could also take. What are you doing? Why are you following me? Hmm? Defy or defuse? I just came to see if you were okay. You want to be friends? Is that it? It's lunchtime. Don't eat with the good girls. I was just trying to help. That wasn't uh, what I thought she was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sliss. Cake. Mm, not the cake. <gasps> Why not the cake? They're watching. Have the fruit. They like it when you have the fruit. Um. It's pretty. It's pretty. It's a butterfly. Just like you. Aren't you hungry? You have yeah, to eat. You call me a butterfly. If you don't eat, you'll waste away. And we have work to do. <laughs> what is her deal, I wonder? You missed a spot. Here. Um, yeah, I want to know about the butterfly, thanks. What did you mean at lunch when you said I was a butterfly? Oh, yeah. Well, you're not a rabbit or a deer or a fox. Place. Jam the door. I 
didn't even see what the other option was there. They can't hear us in here, but they'll come. They always do. Who? Who's coming? They're all part of it. If you saw the flowers, you'd know. Kirsty? Kirsty, what are you doing? I have to be good or they'll hurt him. You don't know if she's just a crazy or if she's just actually onto something. No, you're not supposed to have the door closed. It's okay. The mop fell, but I fixed it. Erica was helping. Look under the pillow. I'm utterly intrigued by this story. Um, what oh, are they had an option to hide under the pillow then. Why are they watching us? They come in the night and show you the animals. Then they give you the pink stuff and you forget. Look under the pillow. You'll see. This might just be somebody that's got like paranoia going on. Or it might be something more. Oh dear. A fox. A rabbit. And a butterfly. Just drawn loads of the same things. So what do you reckon? Girl who was playing the piano. Feisty girl. Cleaner girl. Me. <laughs> I like the rabbits best. They're my favourite. Hello? Jesus, you scared the crap out of me. It's from Doc Ballard. There's the pink stuff. A little housewarming present. Perfume. Thank you. No worries. It's nice to have a new face around. All done. You just turn the dial and you're good to go. Thanks. I'm not going to use that though. No. <laughs> not if I have the option anyway. Pink stuff? I don't reckon. butterfly mask on that person in the earlier dream thing. Why are we outside? <laughs> we sleepwalk. Blonde hair. Not thickens. And look what the cat dragged in. Where the hell have you been? I've been looking everywhere. You've got mail. Looks expensive. <laughs> it's got no red patches on it, has it? It's so pretty. <laughs> the last parcel we got wasn't great. Open it. Which is exactly what Erica's thinking, isn't it? 
like, oh, please don't be body bits. That's my doll. Jesus, it's hideous. It is. Be careful. Body bits. Nice. Fox was mailed yesterday. We're still trying to get a description of the sender. Here, take a look at this. That's Carl Steinbeck's place, the night manager. Got a team there now. <laughs> He's missing. Was it his? The skin? It's not official. But it's the same tattoo. Yeah. I don't know if I trust the Is guy at the desk. There's no body. But it doesn't look good. I don't know if I trust him. And then there's this. Why send the doll? Because they're bloody creepy and they wanted to creep me out. And they succeeded. <laughs> um. Uh, it was a gift from Lucian. He gave it to me before my father died. Erica used to spend so much time here, there weren't any other children. I always tried to smuggle her some toys or a treat. This is one of many. We're gonna have to go back to your flat. I need you to have a look around. Make sure there's nothing else missing. You can grab some extra clothes, whatever else you need. It looks like you might be here for a while. Fabulous. Is he with me? You okay then? <laughs> that wasn't locked. Check if the neighbors saw anything. Hmm. Is that my sketchbook? Oh, I could look to that picture. Should look to the picture. Because that's probably the picture of my parents. Open the door, or the door will be forced open. The door is about to be forced open. So 
lot of stuff hanging down. <laughs> I probably shouldn't, but I'm curious and I'm thinking she's dead. Because of the old uh, smell that he was on about. It's not a good sign, is it? I don't know. that door. The body would fall out on me or something. Where is he? This wasn't a very big apartment, if it's anything like mine. What's this? I'm not sure I want to open the cupboard either because I'm worried there'll be like a dismembered head in there or something. apartment. She's been spying on me. <laughs> Carl Steinbeck is dead. This is a crime scene. Oh, it was a guy, was it? Don't I thought it was a girl. Uh, born. Someone in my apartment. Stay here. Do not leave this room. <laughs> Damn thrillers. thing. Not really. <sighs> this is the point where in a normal movie I'd have a pillow that I can hide behind so I can just peek over the top. <sighs> what is all that stuff? I'm not entirely convinced I want to know. That one I was alright with. I am tense though. Holy crap. This is so good. Well, I reckon we know who it's gonna be, don't we? He's on the cast time back. Don't worry. He's just next door. Why don't you pay him a visit? Carl Steinbeck was the night guard, I've just realised, not the neighbour. So the neighbour might have been a woman. Never forget. You're the butterfly. And they won't stop until they have you. <laughs> I'm tense, man. that symbol again. They won't stop until they have you. Is that the, the Delphi house people? Or is that something else we've not known about yet? I don't really think I want to see his gold arm. Nice. Um, I don't really want to be doing, like investigating this, like, but 
but I'm gonna. Uh. Oh, don't touch anything. There was no one in your apartment. Come on, we need to get you out of here. There absolutely was someone in my apartment. Thank you. I like Hannah. I saw. She's they made me jump. Hannah, get well soon, Kirsty. She's sick. I hope she gets better. But you should sign a card just in case. The last one didn't get better. She was Toby's friend. She used to draw a lot, even though she was really strange. Oh, crap. They caught her looking for ghosts down <laughs> in the basement. It was meant to be all like, that's pretty bad. Erica. Oh, no, I'm terrible at these. He I'm miles away from where... <laughs> that says Erica, okay? <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> when you're bad, they take you away and show you the animals. Then you forget. My daddy told me about it. But I have been bad. They know I talk to you. They broke the tape. That's how I know. See? Did you have it in there that if they know you've seen it, they'll take you away and make you forget. The symbol. Again. You can't get inside. You haven't got a key. Where does one get a key? I can peek around the corner, that's really cool. Bella took her. Where? What does it matter? She's not coming I back. I think it matters quite a lot. I have strange dreams. I think Bella's fully born. Me too. Toby, you're bleeding. Oh, what is going on in this place? But what Hannah had now, and I'll bet that's what her friend had as well that died because they're doing something weird here. Mm, this is so intriguing. We're just going to go over some of the evidence from the flat. Most of what we've got is back in the lab, but there's a couple of things we'd like you to look at. There's okay. no need to worry. The Chief Inspector asked that we do it here. I'm not sure I trust you. Why aren't we doing it at the police station? You've been through enough, Erica. We just want you to be as comfortable as possible. Bull. Come on, then. Kettle's on. So where is this place? Please. Chief Inspector. What do you think? Are we close? Is that her? I don't know. No. Something's missing. Okay. What about this? We found it in her apartment. Is 
ました。の。に。お。名前はミア・グリーン。She was a patient at Delphi House. She was very close to your mother. She was very protective of her. Sometimes aggressively so. Protective. She was difficult, sometimes violent. Her childhood was extremely unpleasant. Your mother's friendship gave her great comfort. Erica. The night your mother died, Mia Green broke into the dispensary. She yeah, took an overdose was... and died. Wait, what? Mia Green died. But that's yeah. But I saw her. We filed an order with the judge to exhume the body. Until then, and then she has a twin sister. You don't explain why she's got the hole in the wall. She's maybe looking no, up, I've got it. trying to look after me. Wait, wait, wait. Because of something my dad did, and she liked my mum. Corker residence. Yes, this is Sergeant Blake. Right away. I've got to go. There's an intruder at Delphi House. I'm coming with you. Not you. It's not safe. I'm going to insist. I'm going. No, Erica. He's right. There's nothing you can do. Erica, you okay? You're bleeding. Oh no. Google. I'll, I'll look after him. That is a bad sign. That is a very bad sign. Bathroom studio. And the hall. Can't miss it. I don't like you. Don't know why. Don't like you. <laughs> Probably just because I'm completely on edge about everything right now. I'm suspicious of anyone. Now we should open the window. <laughs> that would probably be me climbing out the window if this was my like me in this situation. Like, well, they're broken glass, I'm leaving. Bye. <laughs> I'm surely going to be like the prime suspect right now. Hey, that's um, I've got a name. What's her name? What's the AJ thing? That's the key. Hello, Erica. That's not the same person. Jealousy. Is it? Um, you're dead. 
Not yet. Not like the Chief Inspector or the others. Steinbeck. Yes, Joel. why is this happening? They Are they cold together? I'd never hurt you. Well, then you can put down the gun, can't you? Oops. I want the contempt, please. You're insane. He gave them his daughter. His own flesh and blood. I'm here to protect you. Um... He killed my father. He made me a monster. He took your mother and locked her away. There's another world beneath Dilthy House. Secret passages and hidden doors to get you there. I gave you the medallion, the key to everything, but you gave it away. Uh. But there's another. It's right there in front of you. <sighs> the locks are in the walls. Find one and see for yourself. I've already seen one. There's an old farm out in the woods between here and Delphi House. I'll wait for you there. Okay. Come alone. See, now, if she wanted to kill me, she would have done. Like, she's had plenty of opportunities now. So I'm thinking some sort of weird cult thing going on under Delphi House, which my dad is a member of. Just one of the girls trying to break into the pharmacy. Girl. Toby Newman. She's got a history. You should have seen it coming. <laughs> That's how she knew about stuff as well, because her dad's part of the cult. I'm going with cult. <laughs> so the killer broke into the pharmacy as well though probably because she got whatever was going on with toby and hannah because of whatever they're doing here you okay is there anything i can do i'm gonna reach short okay let's try and get some sleep you'll be safe here i promise you um we both know that's not true. It's okay. Just try not to worry. So why would they kill the guy that was on the Oh no, she killed him. Yeah. yeah. Are you sure she didn't say anything? Anything that could help us find her. I'm telling you nothing until I know nothing. what's going on a bit more. Because I don't know if what you're in on it. You need anything. <laughs> it's bizarre to be trusting a killer more than uh, I'm trusting him, but I can't see a reason that she would be telling me to do this stuff. Like, what would be her motivation? Serious eruptions for what I'm doing here. This is my life's work. Do you understand that? Yeah, what exactly are you doing here, Mother? It's not for you to know. <laughs> it doesn't seem like anything's for me to know at the moment. You just do your job and concentrate on looking after Eric in a proper it. fashion. A proper fashion. That's all I'm going to say to you. Proper, eh? Oops. <laughs> I 
<laughs> just like, I don't know whether they can spot me if I uh, stick my head out too far. Lock the door with the chair. Daddy's dead. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. He's dead. He's dead and I have nowhere else to go. It doesn't matter what I do, they're going to take me and they're going to make me bleed. They're going to make me forget him. Abandon. I'm not going to abandon her. What is happening here? What if they catch you? They'll never let you go. I won't let them. I promise. I hope. I'm thinking like I need her on my side because otherwise she panics and draws attention. Things will go tits up. like that I should have gone and looked at that. It looks like there's someone in that chair. Who is that? Is that like body bits? Is that a brain? I don't know how to tell. Probably shouldn't have left that open. when they said about um no. when they said about the animals because she was showing us things of animals oh we have like a timed thing 
It's timed now. <laughs> It's not working. I have no more phone to swipe. <laughs> oh no, why should be doing this? I know that she's in there. Seen me coming out of there. I feel like I should have told my policeman that what was going on now. But then he would have just gone to the farm rather than looking into all this stuff, wouldn't he? Where are we? Is this the? Is this the? farm that she was on about. right now. like what was in the fridge. <laughs> ah, she like sprayed me or something. What a bitch. <laughs> I maybe jumped a little bit. <laughs> I sound like on edge. <laughs> of the future for wealth and power. But they cannot see without a butterfly. That's why they took your mother. That's why they want you.
join me. Together we can save her. Together we can set her free. I'm too curious to know what's going on. Because something bad's happened in a Delphi house. So, you know. It's you. been you. <laughs> she would tell me about the future. Is this the room? Wonderful things that only she could see. Yeah, I was thinking about this. By the great priestess, marked with a butterfly. Why did you bring me here? Because this is where it all began. Your father made it. He tested it on your mother. He tested it on you too. Breathe it in and I can make you do anything. It's how he brainwashed us and made us his slaves. Pink perfume. A little housewarming present. Perfume. Glad I threw it away now. <laughs> I like the rabbits best. They're my favorite. I'm taking these to Doc Ballard. We're making perfume. What do you think it did to you? This is why she was coughing in the I'm beginning. Dying. How much longer? It doesn't matter. I know I'm a monster. I deserve to die. Your mother had that mark. It's why your father wanted her. It's why they want you too. A girl. To stare into the flames and see the future. How do you know about the priestess in the fire? How do you think? He was one of them. See for yourself.
Your father convinced Lucian that by adding signs to ritual, they could see into the future and control it. Your mother was the missing piece. Your mother's alive. She is. But she's fading. Without her, they're blind. They won't see us coming. So they've still got her under Delphi House somewhere. We can end this. We can set her free. They're surely going to know that I'm, like, up onto them, though. Keep it. You may need to use it. I hope not. In there. We've been in there one time. The medallion. I did I thought I saw her on her neck earlier, but I wasn't hundred percent sure after she left. that on a phone because you don't have a like a whole wide circle to go around. Follow me. Did she just kill him or knock him out? We can't let him live. He'll raise the alarm. I'm not killing him. No, sorry, I'm not going to jail at the end of all this. That was Let's go. a bit abrupt. They'll just come and turn the back on again. Take me to the hidden door. We don't have much time. Everywhere. What happened? Where did you go? Uh, I'm gonna warn him. You need to go. She's here. It's okay. There's, there's no one here. It's just you and me. She killed him. Damn. Is he? We need to move. Was he 
actually. <laughs> you can't take any chances. You have to save your mother. You have to do whatever it takes. Oh, man. Take this. Promise me. If you need it, use it. supposed to be seeing right now. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. Let's see that guy. Because the superintendent, that was that guy, wasn't it? Her dad? Or was it not? I don't even know. Uh, help Green. There's someone in the corridor. She's injured. Help her. This is probably gonna end in disaster. I'm probably making all of the wrong choices. can't be in here. Toby needs her treatment. Wake her up. They're looking for you. Then. I'm they a woman on the edge. found a body in the garden. Yes, I'm aware. I think you might be unwell. Wake her up. That's too dangerous. It's her treatment. You can't just pull her out. It takes time. Tubes out, she's going to start to fit. But I'll give us some epinephrine in the cabinet. I'll have to put it straight in her heart. Toby! Run, Kirsty! <laughs> Tubes out. <laughs> Do something. Emma, 
Um, get her out of here. I still don't know what this place is supposed to be doing. I don't know what it is doing, but I don't know what it was supposed to be. Like, what's the cover of its premise? It's Delphi House. Hello, Lucian. Erica? Hi. What you got here? What's happened? It's me. Yes, I'm aware. Standing in the middle of a spooky cult place. Please. <laughs> Put the gun down. Nope. Whatever's happened, whatever's the matter, we can work it out. I promise. That's it. Just talk to me. Whatever you think is happening here, we can work this out. Give me your medallion. America. Making any sense. You need to calm down. You're scaring me. I think you might be sick. I think you need help. I know you've been taking the girls. Doing experiments. It's not an experiment, it's their treatment. The girls are sick. We help them. We make them better. I want to help you too. You're dangerous. More dangerous than you know. I don't believe you. I don't believe anything you say. You don't have to believe me. You broke in here with a gun. But you're pointing right at me, contemplating murder. <laughs> I don't think this is the first time you've felt this way. I think you need help. My God, what have you done? I know what I saw. I know what's real. Maybe, but there's definitely something wrong with you. Poison. Poison in your mind. It's been there a very long time. Oh, man, I don't know whether or not to like trust Please. myself. Trust me. I don't trust you. That's the problem. Put the gun down. I don't particularly want to shoot you, but I do not trust you. Your green is dead. It's in your head. It's a fantasy. <sighs> that was probably a mistake. It's okay. If you trust me, I can make you better. I can make it all go away. No. I don't believe you. You don't have to worry anymore. Oh. No! Damn it, I should have killed him! I promised I would use the gun if I needed to, and I didn't. Erica, can you hear me? Look, Erica. It's right there. Right there in front of you. See? It's magical. 
I think you are too. Sedated, restrained, a patient or prisoner, haunted by old ghosts, Erica remains. Oh man, that's the end. I have no idea, like, I have no idea what the actual, like, real situation was. Holy crap, that was so good. Oh my word, I'm gonna have to play through, like, a whole bunch of those other things and just see what the other outcomes could be. What would have happened if I'd killed him? The fact was that it was because it said murder him, I was just like, I can't do it. I got loads of trophies. Wow. Prisoner. Yeah, see, I, I would have obviously gotten away, maybe, if I'd done it. I don't know. Damn. I was so torn. Ah, uh, that was so good. That was so good. I want more things like that. That was really cool. Man, I'm gonna have to like just There's so many potential different like things you could do in that as well though. There were loads of like choices that would take you in different places. Like going and seeing either Han or Percy or Toby, where I went to see Toby. Answering the phone or going down the corridor. Oh that was so good. I really enjoyed that. Ah. Well, and you have to just play the whole thing, I guess. That was so cool. I really, really like that. Ah. Okay. Well, anyway, that's that's it for this episode. Or that bit. Um. Ah oh man, I need to know what the other outcomes were. Dang. <laughs> Well, I guess we'll um, see you next time, folks. <laughs>